Imagination also plays an important part in your subjective life as it gives mobility to your beliefs. It is one of the motivating agencies that helps transform your beliefs into physical experience. It is vital, therefore, you understand the interrelationship between ideas and imagination. In order to dislodge unsuitable beliefs and establish new ones, you must learn to use your imagination to move concepts in and out of your mind. The proper use of imagination can then propel ideas in the directions you desire. Now this marks the end of chapter three, the nature of personal reality. Seth speaks. And this was part seven. Let's talk about it. But this time, let's do it in story format. Let's have a little fun. Let's begin. In the heart of downtown Los Angeles, amid the hustle and bustle of city life, lived a woman named Lizette. Lizette had recently faced the unfortunate circumstance of losing her job, leaving her feeling uncertain about the future. However, Lizette was not one to succumb to despair easily. You see, she firmly believed in the power of imagination and the ability to shape one's destiny through the mind. Embracing the wisdom that imagination is a driving force in shaping beliefs into reality, Lizette decided to channel her energy into manifesting a better opportunity. She spent her days exploring the diverse neighborhoods of Los Angeles, letting her imagination roam freely as she visualized the ideal job that aligned with her passions and skills. One day, as Lizette strolled through the city streets, she stumbled upon a vibrant community center. The atmosphere resonated with creativity and innovation. It was there that she felt a spark of inspiration igniting her imagination with possibilities. Lizette envisioned herself contributing to the community, making a positive impact through her unique talents. Determined to turn her vision into reality, Lizette engaged with the people at the community center. She shared her ideas, collaborated with like-minded individuals, and allowed her imagination to guide her toward new opportunities. As she immersed herself into the creative environment, Lizette found herself developing connections and skills she hadn't even realized she possessed. Through the interrelationship between her ideas and imagination, Lizette began to dislodge the limiting beliefs that had surfaced after losing her previous job. Instead of dwelling on setbacks, she focused on the potential for growth, the potential for transformation. Her vibrant imagination propelled her ideas in the direction of positive change. Soon enough, Lizette's efforts bore fruit. She secured a position at the community center where she could now blend her passion for community engagement with her professional skills. The job not only provided financial stability, but also a sense of purpose and fulfillment that went beyond what she had initially imagined. Lizette's story serves as a testament to the profound impact of imagination, to the profound impact of belief in shaping one's destiny. In the dynamic landscape of downtown Los Angeles, her journey showcases the transformative power of creativity and the ability to manifest a brighter future through the proper use of imagination. If you've enjoyed this reading, please consider giving it a like, sharing it with a friend, and of course, subscribing for more. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you won't miss any videos. This was the end of chapter three, so we'll be moving on to a new chapter very soon. So stay tuned. What did you think about this particular reading? Please leave it in the comments below. And as always, I am Tony Victory, a wolf uncaged. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Have a great day or a great evening. Thank you.